here and you got to be willing to do the things that need to be done so that you could grow it it's going to take a lot of extra work but it's going to be better for you it's going to be healthier for you and the person in your life is going to appreciate that the person in your life the man or whatever your significant other in your life is going to appreciate that hopefully it's a man but you know what you know today is today so you know the significant other that you have in your life is going to appreciate you for what you're doing and the, what you're presenting to, to present the presentation that you're going to have for them it's just like a man who works out every day and you get to be with somebody that looks like that you like that you you like looking at that okay same thing with men you don't want no man with no with, with muscles in his arms that he you 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 touch his arms and feel like it feel like um what do you call that rubber and he got to he said hold on I got to blow my muscles up and he put a he put his mouth on the tube and just blow it and make his muscles get bigger you go what that's crazy and see nobody wants something like that we would rather have somebody who is healthier but we still take the black woman because you know saw a woman and even though she doing that kind of stuff we still try it we still take her we're, but now we're trying to educate her into number one being healthier number two stop uh, stop uh, paying uh, another stop giving people who don't uh, care about our community all this money with this buying this hair and with this whole industry we can shut this industry down if we just get on a natural tip because we could buy these natural products from each other instead of going to other people because they would put think about this the people you buying this hair from they wouldn't even buy nothing they wouldn't buy nothing from you nothing uh, anything from you so why would why are you giving them all this money you're giving them so much money most of these places don't even open on saturday on sundays that's how much money they making off of you with this hair and this and these nails that's how much money when you can learn how to do this all for yourself it's going to take you longer it's going to be more in, involved but you're going to be healthier and you're going to look better and you're going to feel better you're going to be proud of yourself anyway um i'm going to give you some information on some long hair regimens i'm not to say that everybody doesn't everybody shouldn't everybody is not made for long hair but i'm giving you the option if that's you i'm going to give you the information and then you can decide for yourself if this is something that you want to do i'm just saying that instead of i'm giving this information out mainly to people who uh, are you know mainly most women i notice they they are they if they're involved there's two things that they try to have uh take um maintain at a certain level if they're trying to attract the opposite sex or attract men and that is hair and nails so I'm trying to give you natural solutions to how to get those two things happening so you don't have to be putting your health at risk by doing um, you know, synthetic things so gonna give you the long hair natural long hair regimens I'm, and I'm not by any means saying everybody every black woman should have long hair down to their, down to their waist I'm not saying that I'm just giving you the option some people gonna want that some people want that so don't want that that's fine that was just giving you the option I'm just saying we should try to get away from these these synthetic things like the wigs and the weaves as much as possible because it's not gonna be good for our hair gonna be good for us hair wise and our hair and you know it's just not gonna be good for us and we don't know the kind of lifestyle the people live that gave us that stuff we don't know if uh, how bad it was radiated plus we putting radiation in our hair i mean this is crazy the radiation at night the radiation could get seep into our hair and damage the dna in our hair i mean it's just crazy man so we're not even thinking about that natural nail regimens okay so you know i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna give you links and information to people that are doing this stuff black people that's doing this stuff growing their hair and people that look like you growing their hair and growing their nails naturally all right because the ultimate the goal is to have our people in a position where they can um 
you know, well, we if we're going to spend all this money, we're going to spend money like this. We should spend money with each other. We can create industries with each other. Why should we be giving everybody else this money? Plus, you'll be healthier and you'll feel better and we'll all be better people behind it. It's going to take some discipline. You can't get your hair this long and this long overnight. It's going to take some discipline and patience. You're going to have to follow a regimen. You're going to have to follow a regimen. You're going to do You're going to have to do it To get to what you want But how bad do you want it And how bad do you want it For the person that's involved in your life If that's what you want If the person in your life likes your Your weaved long hair How much better would they like Your natural long hair Gotta think about that Gotta think about that Gotta think past just today Gotta think past about tomorrow Yeah your weave was tight now Today and it'll be tight a year from now and it'll be tight two years from now but eventually they're going to go to weave your hair they're going to take that weave down and the rest of your hair is going to come out with that weave that's not going to be cute I would rather have my own hair up in here that way I ain't got to worry about what they're going to take out that makes sense to me anyway this is all going to require discipline and patience you're going to have to learn how to do this stuff you're going to have to get back to learning how to do this stuff for ourselves and stop paying people to do this stuff or paying people that don't um, that's not in our community that's not going to circulate the money back in our community uh, and, you know with us to do this stuff we're going to have to start doing it for each other anyway so that's that is basically the information I'm going to give you hang on tight we're going to go through a couple videos and I'm going to put the links to all of this information in the description box so just hang tight alright we're going to take another somebody else it's uh, you know, person number one and their little hair journey take a look This is a black woman, right? Okay. So we're looking at a black woman who is growing her own natural hair. Okay. Okay. I just want to make sure nobody said, oh, this is a light skin. Okay. So that's that's 
lady number one. Uh, we got a couple other ones. Hold on to your hat. We got a couple more people we got to get to. Let's let's uh, let's get to them. Okay, here we go. Let's take a look at her. That is a black woman, right? Okay, so there's no trick photography here. There's nothing. Okay, all right. Okay, so you see, <laughs> yes, definitely, this is a black sister, and, uh, oh. By the way, now these chicks are mixed. These chicks are all black. Both parents black. Okay. See, took this this is two years, right? Two years into this. Three years into this now. Three years. So it's gonna take some time and some discipline. I'm trying to tell you, black woman, you could do this if you really want to. Okay, I'm going to leave you the description and her, her uh, information in the description box. Let's move on to the next person. She's obviously happy with what she's got going on. Let's move on to the next person. Oh, I got a gang of people because y'all say, oh, you can't do it. Okay, I'm going to show you you can do it. This is I'm about to show you here also who has grown her hair uh, to, I think, waist length. I think, yeah, I think waist length. Um, and let's take a look at her.
this is this this sister is a this is a black woman, right? This is this okay. I just want to make sure this is a black woman because I'm you got trick people. In, okay, I'm, I'm I have no, tr no tricks, nothing. This is just regular people that we got here. Okay. magic trick right this is not no magic trick this sister definitely does not have no weave in her head she's combing her natural hair right that she grew out she looked just like you she grew it out but she took the two three four year journey whatever it took for her to get her hair this long okay Okay, basically that's all I wanted us to see is to see that you know this could be done okay this could be done here I'm gonna put these people's and other people's information in the, in the link in description box so that you can connect with them all right let's move on to the next person because I know they say black women can't grow long here I know that you got to have some type of you got to have a white person in your family or you got to have some Indian in your family or whatever right they got all these different reasons why you okay we just we just saw two people, now we're going to see another person. Okay, we're going to do four things for us. Actually, I'm going to actually do five things for us. Number one, rate this video. Give us a rating. Let us know if you like what, you, what we're trying to do. Tell us what you think and what we can do to improve to make the people get better. Because that's the ultimate goal, is to get these men and women to stop going to prison and start building better black families and better black people so we can all be better people on this planet. Next, give us your comment. You know, tell us what you think uh, and what we can do to improve to help the people get better. Like I said, that's the ultimate goal. If you like, if you think what we say makes sense, talk about it and leave us a comment. We appreciate that. And now to get the ball rolling and then we'll start talking about some of these tough issues and maybe we can do something about them. Next thing is to like this video. If you like what was said or something we're doing, we would like to know that you support us. We're not asking for donations, just the push of a button. That's all we ask for, a few clicks of the button, a few clicks of the mouse screen, the mouse, uh, oh, mouse, a few clicks of the mouse, and then, um, you know, we will, they'll show us that you support what we're doing. Uh, share this video next thing is to share this video share this video in your sh social network if you like what was said or something we're doing please share this video on your in your social media network and talk about it with your friends if you think people if you think people need to hear this message then please share it as much as possible thanks for your support yeah just share as much as possible with this video with you might have a nephew or cousin that needs to hear this kind of thing or it might have people in your own network that need to hear this just on your social network just please share it as much as possible. And the last thing is, remember, we have the Urban Male Life Skills Boot Camps. That's our flagship program. We have other things. We have the home study course. We have the uh, worksheets and workbooks. But this is the flagship program to help our people 
try to get better so that we can stop having these young men and women go to prisons, particularly the men, because once we get the men, then I believe that the women will follow. So once, once we get them to stop going to prisons, then we, the women will follow, and then we will bring our, our community closer together, and we can stop uh, being in a pitiful condition we're in and start standing up and uh, doing some things to help our people get employed and have better lifestyles. So anyway, uh, those are the things that we need you to do. We, we ask you to do. Please help us in this cause. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it.